In this video, I just wanted to go over the new character, Plotty. Uh, Toph is currently celebrating the one and a half year anniversary, and because of that, which I think is a great thing, uh, they've rerun pretty much every character that's available. Uh, so you can you can pretty much pick and choose which banner here you would like to use. They all share the same pity with the same flame gold here at the bottom. I think this is great, and that's including not like, the newer characters, even like Bar uh, Brevi, Yan Meow, or you even get the cutscene for this. Okay, that's quite nice. So there you go. So basically, they've rerun all the banners. But in this video, we're not going to look at those. Uh, I've already covered most of these characters in other videos and other trials. Not to grace, I'm just doing their trials and taking a first look at them. Uh, but this is the new character, Plotty, who didn't play the intro there. Ooh. Oh, I expected to. I expected an intro that I didn't really play. Okay, well, whatever. Uh, we're just going to briefly look at a simulacra. And then uh, I'll briefly look at our kit, and I'm going to try with my scuffed DPS team. My main kit is built around Fortitude, so this isn't going to be a great representation, but we're just going to go in and, and hit things. She should be actually at the top here. Sure. Oh, these are all the ones I've owned, so I'm half asleep here. So she'll be here. Why yeah, there you, you go. Looking at me? Is, is there something on my face? Great looking character. Uh, enjoyed her part in the story so far. They've also got a gacha skin available for her currently. Which I'm quite usually a fan of a lot of their gacha skins. I think they're all really quite clean. But this one, I'm not so sure. Because it completely changes her body shape and everything. But whatever. People, you know, if people like it, people like it. But if, if anything, it should be maybe the other way around. I don't know. But anyway. Really great looking character. Seemingly using a projectile weapon. Uh, I've not done this before. I'm going to try and use this scuff team, which is using uh, Annabella's trait. We have Annabella. It should replace Cobalt. Hopefully, all going to plan. Uh, it usually replaces that end one. But if I take a brief look at her kit here, uh, into skills. See if there's anything that stands out. Jump attack, normal combo. It's a normal attack and then hold. Then a hold attack. Jump, tap, and hold. Okay, that's different. So what does that do? Uh, using both can launch an attack ahead. Doing okay, it's just charge attack maybe. Jump and hold. Jump and dash. Trigger diving protocol, dealing damage. I'm not sure we'll be using any of that. Jump, dodge, and normal attack. I see my main dodge attack. So there's no actual... Um, we're in between mind and reality, creating eight mirror heart mirrors rules around the Wanderer. Normal attacks now fire explosive shots that deal damage equal to 180% of attack. Consumes endurance. Gains weapon charge after it ends. Okay, let's go. Let's let's just have a go. I've not uh, I've not done this yet, so we'll give it a go. We enjoy this leisure. We're like we're just gonna go in here and randomly hit stuff. I might change it up, but I feel theoretically this is the, the closest sort of team for me. If I was to pull for Plotty, this would probably be you know replace Cobalt. Like Tom, you replace Cobalt with Leah. Okay, I'm just, just weapons, guns, bang bang, keep them together. Holy moly! Aimbot? Question mark. Man, they've definitely cooked here. Eh? You got like a gun animation on the right. It shows how much ammo you got left. Ah, uh, it's changed up. Ah, it's changed up my buttons again every time. Weapons aren't in the right place. I do wish not to be... I know they've... It's been like that for a while now, but I wish it wasn't like that. I wanted to use Plotty's Discharge. So can I... No, you have to tap. It's the tap thing. You can't... You can't hold attack. Wow, well, everything's just dead again. I should probably show my scuffed stats. So, what is this? Go into Annabella. No, wrong one, but whatever. She's on four. Wow, we get a lot of charge. Oh. 
I don't think I've seen that. That was like a nuke. That was pretty cool. I've got 14,000 flame attack, apparently. I thought it was a lot less than that. Uh, but you can see here, my kit's mainly built into resistance, so... Oh, that's actually cooler than I thought it would be. I thought this was her discharge. This is her skill. What's on this mirror? It's a picture of her on the mirror. <laughs> that's a pretty cool effect. Uh, okay, well, seemingly very powerful. Let's go back into Annabella. I don't know... I don't know if... I don't know if Annabella... Uh, Lan is going to be... Can I get out of the air? Dude, I don't want to be floating like that. It's horrible. So you go into this animation, but then you just drop this, like, nuke. Oh, this is actually really cool. Oh, my days. I actually like this. This is a problem. I wasn't initially planning to pull on Plotty. I can't really afford it at this point. I was trying to get a facer. Uh, Trying to get a face or a constellation, but or ascension. This isn't like I thought it would be at all. This is very different. I like the little slide slide she does on the dash. So what was it? There was you just threw a bomb out. So Dare I say, it kind of feels like Subasa always should have been. I main Subasa like at the very beginning of this game. And it just, this kind of feels like what Subasa should really be like. To me, like immediately. Like this, like agile, you got all these animations, characters moving a lot. This is cool, I like this. I haven't seen too many people really talk about Plotty though. I assume people didn't really like her or something. They want to just kill everyone. Oh, wow. I haven't really been playing Toph uh, so actively on, on the EU server recently. Um, just been doing my dailies and... Taking a little bit of a break from it. I've noticed some of the server hasn't been as active with bosses and... But the new upcoming updates are going to be pretty big. And even like this anniversary event, I think, has probably brought people back. I'm just spending more time in other places. Is she a DPS? I mean, she feels very on field. This is kind of crazy. Like a. Yeah, it's like a mixture of like Annabella. So I think immediately, if you like Annabella game gameplay like I do. I'd say this is probably a must. But then what team? I don't know. I would almost say a team like this. I mean, we will swap into Leekwa instead of Annabella, maybe. I'm actually finding Annabella is still really good, though. But I don't use this team, right? This, this is, I said, it had a Cobalt in it. I don't use this team because I'm a I'm tank. So this is just kind of like when I'm... Like I just did before this video, I just want to want to go and kill like Frostbolt or some random bosses on my own. I'll use a team like this just because I want to have some fun with it. I quite like the challenge and I feel the rotations feel good. But this is cool. I keep picking the wrong. I usually go for gas mode but because I've selected the wrong one. It keeps pre-selecting the wrong one because of my muscle memory. I'm going to spawn. Let's just use a nuke. Oh, wait, so, okay, so it won't one-shot them, so it's not. This is cool, though. They cook some really, really cool animations with the characters. I think it's, it's definitely where Tower of Fantasy spend a lot of their time is on the characters and the kit and the weapon and everything. And you can tell. You can tell. It's really cool. This is a lot of fun. This is a lot of fun. I suggest if you're half interested, just check it out. This is pretty cool. Even just her normal attacks here. 
And I wouldn't say it's like ranged, and I kind of wouldn't say it's really close quarters. It's got like a mix of both, really. I guess depending what you want to do. Definitely strong though. Even with my scuffed team, this is strong. So I imagine she must be very strong if you've got if you're a flame build. dead I said before I could do it with these enemies being a bit stronger maybe I can do that I don't know yeah that's cool you can do like a dash beam with it but to be honest the normal attack seems so strong anyway I think uh, I've I've won the 50-50 twice, so I'm on pity, and I've pulled quite a bit, and I've still not got an early an early loss. So my account's not really in a good position to really pull for plot, even if I wanted. I'd have to lose before I can win again. Yeah, this is cool. I said, I haven't really been playing this last week, so I don't know how popular she's been. I know, like, for example, when, like, Nanyin came out. Well, we're, like, we're doing nothing here. Why are they, like, glowing red? All of a sudden, the damage seems very low there. I've just got land doing a load of off-field. Do a new, you can then go into a skill. Maybe I'm missing, I'm probably missing something. Ah, I might. It almost seems like if you shoot too quickly, it doesn't. Almost misses a shot. I don't know. Ah, uh, no, I know. Oh, it's because muscle memory is kicking in. And is usually on four for me. And lands usually on three, but lands now on five and Plotty's on four. I don't know, it's all it's all scuffed. Nuke. That's cool. Be interesting to see how that really works out. And if that applies burn or something, I don't know, maybe. Yeah, this is a cool character. Obviously, she, as I said, the simulacra, she looks great. Don't know how much investment a character like like Plotty really needs. Feels really good. Actually, you know, to be fair, we're also being a bit unbiased here. This is a maxed out character, so... I don't know how she would exactly feel at A1 or even A0. I'd like to think she'd still feel pretty good. Uh, that's down to what the ascensions do. How do we back out of it? Yeah, there we go. If you enjoyed this, please leave a like. It was just me randomly hitting stuff. I'm, I'm trying to think of whatever team quickly if I wanted to use her and I would use her in, but I don't know. I guess you could say a relief were, but it's, in Flame, it's kind of is what it is, really. I don't know if she's got... Uh, let's go and have another read of the main kit. I don't know if she's got... Swift cut or whatever it is, but basically you can... Ah, oh, there. It looks like she must possibly does here. Fusion of flame. I guess she's flame physical. I didn't realize. Actually, flame physical. I didn't realize. I think obviously mainly flame. I don't know where the physical really comes into it other than creating teams. Uh, calculated based on the flame, on the highest flame physical base attack. This could an increased physical attack. Yeah, so plus you, it does it does seemingly count. Yeah, your HP and your resistance types plus one hundred and sixty eight percent of crit. That's a there we've got some really random values. Is that more than than Lihua? 
Uh, how do I see that? Ah, two hundred percent. But then I think Yulan is only like thirty percent or something weird. Fifty-five percent of crits. So there's some really weird values on some of these. But obviously, same deal. Uh, I don't know about Facer, uh, who's not currently on any of my stuff because I just use her for flying around at the minute. I, if I do, I'll swap her out, swap her out for a Liqua, and I'll just fly around, usually in like domains and stuff. Uh, plus sixty-eight percent of crit with with face. So really random values on some of these. I guess it's they've obviously had to calculate it depending on the scaling. Oh, don't do that. Bloody headset. Sorry. Uh, yeah, that seems pretty good. So you you could mix her in again with someone a kit like mine. You could mix her in. I don't think I would. There's too much field time, I would say, there uh, for tanking, maybe. But they are about to do a big collab uh, with an anime I've not really heard of, but it looks really cool. And I think we're going to get a new Fortitude character, so which could be flame physical, but don't don't quote me on that. So that could be interesting to see how Plotty would work with maybe a separate, maybe I'd have to build a separate Fortitude team. And to be honest, that's kind of what I'd like, really. My main two is this Saki team with with Huang, and then my main, my very main set I use is Lan Li Huo and, and Huang. This is just, I can tank everything. I can tank everything in the game with this easy. Uh, and it works really well. So thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.